stop your life. Listen, believe for a miracle. Even go to your phone and call the prayer partners here at TBN Philadelphia. They're going to pray with you that you're going to have a divine alignment. There's a shift coming in your life. There's a change coming. I believe as I'm holding, we're, listen, hold it with me. As we're holding these medicines in our hands, there are thousands of people getting in your heart. You are about to get delivered in the name of Jesus, Jesus and you're getting off that medicine you're getting of off of that Xanax yes. you're getting off of all of that Amen. in Jesus name Amen. right now yes, and if God is touching you go to that 610 number and call tell the prayer partners I feel God delivering me right, right now, now in the name of Jesus thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. And we're going to let these sit here because right. we're going to remind the devil he's yes. defeated yes, he's this bag says he's defeated, defeated. Yes. in the name of, of Jesus, Jesus Christ. Now, 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 Glacia, yes, uh, what uh, are you doing now yes. with these props, these pictures, and the deliverance God has given you? What is going on now in your life? The Word of God says we overcome by the blood of the Lamb okay. and the Word of our testimony. So every opportunity that I get, I testify. Ah. I sing about it. I praise the Lord. I sing to Him now and just let others know that with God, nothing is impossible. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Luke chapter 1, verse yes. 37. Yes, nothing and is impossible. What would you just say to someone yes. who maybe is bitter? Mm. Because when you get into something this deep, yeah. bitterness can set in. Oh, definitely. Why God? Yes, why why me? me? What would yes. you say to that person that's wrestling with bitterness? you got to let it go. Ask the Lord to come in and give him direct access into your heart. And, and don't be pretentious about it. If you're hurting about something, tell him. And say, Lord, if you're struggling with it, tell him, Lord, I don't want to walk around with bitterness anymore. This is not of you. Because definitely when you hold on to bitterness, you're holding something that belongs to the enemy. So you have to travel light. Allow the Holy Spirit to rid you of all those burdens. Forg A lot of people are walking with unforgiveness too, you know, Pastor. That's right. They don't want to forgive and they're bitter, they're angry. And, th and if you're angry and holding on to those things, then the Holy Spirit cannot come in. So make room for him. Ask the Lord to help you and release them. Those who wanted to kill me, I bless them. I pray for them and I forgive them. And pray for their children's children that they would come to the knowledge of Jesus Christ. Yes, Jesus. Yes, so it's important to let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Lacey, we're yes. learning so much from you. Number one, have faith. Yes. And don't look at the diagnosis of the doctor, yes, no. but look at the promises yes. of God. Yes, the word of God. Then once you get through it, mm -hmm. put it behind you. Yes. Only use the pictures mm -hmm. and the props. Yes. Can I call them that's props? Right, props fine. of deliverance. Of deliverance. And go around and tell everybody yes. if he did it for me, he'll do it for he'll you. He'll do it for yeah. you. He Thank you, God. Jesus. He shows no favoritism. We just want to praise God. Glacia, right yes. now, Lord. I feel you need to pray Hallelujah. again mm -hmm. for those that are sick mm -hmm. and those that are suffering with bitterness and unforgiveness go on and minister praise God let's yes, pray Jesus. father we thank you that nothing is impossible with you and right now Lord your son your daughter is in the situation where they're struggling God I ask that you'd send your angels now to minister to them we thank you that as this word goes forth into their spirit Lord you've given given us direct access into their spirits and we ask you God give them the grace to forgive to release the bitterness Lord God and to just believe God, because nothing is impossible with you. This is a day of change. I declare that over your lives today. I thank you, Lord, for the window of heaven that has opened up over their lives. Cause them now, Lord Jesus, to hear your voice and to obey you. Thank you, Lord, for forgiveness. Thank you for cleansing them. And we thank you for healing for those who are sick in the name of Jesus. We curse every plot, every assignment of the adversary in the name of Jesus. And we declare that by his stripes, by his you are healed, eternally healed in the name of Jesus Christ. Of Jesus. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. And Hallelujah. Amen. amen. And amen. Go to your phone and give a word of testimony. Yes. Say, I just prayed with Glacia. Yes. Jesus has touched my life. I want to call my TV in Philadelphia and declare by faith, yes. I'm, free. I'm free. I am free. Because if God did it for her, why can't he do it for me right now? Dr. Rick preached earlier, yes. get up off the side of that bed by faith yes. and say, I'm healed. Apostle Warren said the days of miracles are not over. And Glacia says, look at this. Yes. Miracles are alive. 
alive and well today, call that 610 number right now and say, I have been set free by faith in the name of Jesus. And when you're on the phone, before you hang up, give a thank you, Jesus, for TV and gift. Call 610 right now. Hallelujah. Now, Gracie, they yes, tell sir. me you not only go around giving these stories to everybody, mm -hmm. but you also have a music ministry. How yes, long have you been singing? I've been singing since four years old. Since four? Yes, in the Church of God in Newport, Manchester, Jamaica, singing with my mother and my cousins. It's a very musical family, but we love to worship and dance in the presence of the Lord. Hey. It's a blessing. Well, they tell me you Jamaicans can, can uh, do you, it now, right? You know, you know. You know how it is. No, you're right You're now. done, Noah. Hey. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. Yes, sir. That's, and you all like to cook a lot, too. Oh, yes. Yes, yes. We love to cook. And now that you're healed, I, right. guess, I guess you're doing a lot of good eating now, oh, aren't you? Hello. Is it God, God good? Is good. <laughs> now, I didn't mean that, but anyway, it's great. Yes, praise sir. God, yes. God yes. is Amen. good. I, and, and tell us a little bit more yes, uh, about your music ministry, because in a moment, we're going to have you sing for us. Oh, certainly. Yeah. Yeah. Praise God. Since my deliverance, I was able, the Lord has blessed me to record five albums. I recently released one album called, the latest album is You Are My Servant, from Isaiah 41, 9 to 11. It's an album of encouragement. People need to be encouraged. And the, the, the scripture says... I've called you back from the ends of the earth saying, you are my servant. I've chosen you and will not throw you away. Don't be afraid. Don't be discouraged. For I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I'll hold you up with my victorious right hand. On this album, I'm singing in different languages, in Korean, in Spanish, in Soto. Yes. And in English. <laughs> God really did heal you, didn't oh, yes, How many languages do you speak now? I sing a lot of languages. I'm not fluent in oh, any, but I sing. Well, Hallelujah. That, that's fine. You know, all for the glory of God. Yes, Jesus. Yes. So I'm happy to sing and play my guitar and just worship the Lord wherever the doors open up. Because that's why he created me. That's why he preserved me. To let the nations know and to tell of his goodness in any way possible. Amen. Would you do one more thing for yes. us? And then we, we, we're going to have you minister in song. Yes. Uh, why should people seriously support their TBN. Oh, God. I mean, because it seems like it had such an impact on you. I know we moved yes. kind of fast here, but That's it fine. seems like TBN stood out for you. Yes, Why yes. should people pick up that phone and support it? You should invest your resources in TBN. This is true ground. This is good ground. Because because of the ministry of TBN, lives are, like mine are being transformed on a daily basis. And we salute the pioneers of this ministry, Pastor Paul and, and Jan, because without faith, you know, we would not be here today. So, you know, so into your future. You're not buying your miracle, no. But release your faith and, sp and release your seed as well and sow. And let the Lord know that, yay, I'm in line. I'm positioning myself. I'm investing my resources because I believe. And God will do it for you. Amen. 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 Well, we're going to get ready in just a moment here for uh, Glacia to come and Glacia Robinson to, to minister to us in song. And remember, while she's singing, if the Spirit of God stirs you, because there's a heavy anointing on this young lady's life, uh, move while the waters are troubled. Move while the anointing is flowing. While Turn up the music while she's singing. Turn it up in the house and go to the phone and do what God tells you to do. Let's be blessed now by the music ministry of Glacia Robinson. Mm -hmm.
TBN Philadelphia Live. What a night we are having here. And thank you so much, Glacia Robinson, for that powerful music ministry. Uh, in my hand are just some of the phone calls that are coming in. We invite you to call the 610 number for prayer, to show your support for TBN Philadelphia. Uh, this is so exciting here. Someone calls in from Trevos, Pennsylvania. They gave their life to Jesus Christ right on the telephone there. Praise the Lord. Lord, we are excited. Uh, someone calls and says, please pray for, for a two-year-old with an enlarged colon situation. Someone else calls uh, in from the Delaware region and uh, please pray about an upcoming operation uh, that everything uh, will be fine and the Lord will heal me. Someone else is calling in. Uh, I am praying that God will bless our ministry and increase the ministry. They call from the Philadelphia area and uh, someone else calling here again praying for increase uh, in their life and in their ministry. Why don't you call right now, 610, that number. If it's busy, call the other number on your screen. And remember, we're not only praying for you and loving you and here for you 24 hours a day, but we're asking for your support to keep TV in Philadelphia here for you. Well, we continue on this evening 